you were asleep. Anyway, fellas, just talk amongst yourselves. Yeah, we'll just get someone to wake them up. Hello! Hello! Even you, Bob, over there eating. Guess what? The fact that you're in the same room, you are part of this. So we're going to annoy the hell out of you, uh, and possibly a good chance you may be sharing your meal before you get the hell out of here. Is that okay? <laughs> Thanks for coming along. I dare say that you uh, like sitting at round tables because nobody likes sitting up here. All right? So we'll get from there. If you think my sense of humor is bad now, give me about an hour. You'll be all good. Uh, who has travelled to be here this evening? What, couldn't bring a friend? What? So it got none. Well, you'll have a lot of friends before you, uh, you get out of here. Now, here's half the rule. Ray McCoy's my name, by the way. Uh, I actually live here. And uh, Roy McKay, you can call me whatever. There are some other names they call me, but we won't go there, Lance. Well, we can't go there. What I'd like you to do this evening is, because uh, the crowd will grow as, uh, as time goes on, because people don't tell me it's like being late. It's just the way we are, because most of them are married. Anyhow, what I'd like you to do is just make yourself a promise that before you leave here this evening, you know everyone in the room. And if you think that sounds funny, it's not, because country music's all about people, so there's nothing worse than coming in here and going, I wonder who that is. I wonder. Go over and have a yarn. All right, shake your hand, make some new friends while you're here today. Is that okay? Anyone don't want to do that? Front door's over there. Get the hell out of here. Okay, look, we have got a huge show lined up this evening. Um, I apologise for the fact that we couldn't get a decent band, but we'll do the best we can. <laughs> Seriously. Uh, where's Sammy? Will you come up here, Sammy? No! no, no, no. See, that's the best you'll learn this. That was a thing with women. That wasn't a request, was it? It was an order. Sammy, come up here. Come on, give a round of applause. Okay, okay now this wouldn't, uh, wouldn't happen without Sammy's involvement in getting this all going, so... Everyone has fond memories of, of Brian Young, the youngie as everyone knows him, so we'll share a lot of those this evening. Anyone actually knew Brian? That's unreal, isn't it? So you've all got stories? Wonderful. We'll be ducking around to get your name, and there is a part on the program where it says memories of youngie, and every one of you will be coming up to share that memory. <laughs> is that okay? All right? Uh, look, everyone, I'm sure, with, uh, even with Lance over here that played with Youngie, there's so many good stories. Uh, great mates with Troy Cassidy, and Troy just speaks so fondly of, of Youngie and uh, Brian Howdy. Who how, how knows Howdy? Howdy's just uh, he's an absolute legend. And as you may know from Howdy's place, he's got uh, uh, Youngie's room over there and Youngie's stage and Youngie's this and Youngie's that. And um, I don't drink because Howdy drinks my share. Uh, but some of the stories, really, that, that he's got to share about Youngie just are absolutely incredible, and uh, it's, it's amazing. So that's what tonight's all about. So, Sammy, um, you better make... You, uh, you said to me this evening, when Sammy got me to, to compare tonight, she really didn't know what was in for us. So we're here, we're here for the music, but I want to explain. There, we have an agenda as such, but the big agenda is to actually have a lot of fun, share some great memories, and uh, we've got some raffles, all those sorts of things. And that's all good, so okay. Uh, and if you win, is it a bass? It is? No. What is it? It's a Japanese guitar. Okay, that's a tag me. Um, signed by Troy. And what we might do with Troy is then there'll be 12 months free lessons from Troy. Because he's actually having a year off, so he doesn't know yet, but just lob at his door, trust us. Hey Troy, I'm here for the lesson. It's all good. Uh, Sammy, I would really like you to actually give a welcome, if you will. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, everyone. Hi. Hi. Thank you so much for everyone coming here this evening. Um, I'm not really prepared for this speech as yet, because I was going to do that a bit later. But um, thank you to everyone here that's on the stage. I really appreciate everything and all the support from the crowd as well. But I'll do my little bit of a speech a bit later, so I've got one plan. But, um, yeah, Ray put me on the spot. Thanks, Ray. You reckon that's the spot? You want to sing a song? No. Right, get the hell out of here. Yeah, she sings, Bob? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, oh, we can we go. Go. Wait till we can do a shower soon, can we? <laughs> We've got the curtain. This guy, someone duck out and get a bucket of water. This will be a ton of fun. I've got the towel. <laughs> you what? The white shirt. <laughs> This could go anywhere tonight, I'll give you the drunk. I hope we haven't put you off your food. Uh, we're waiting on uh, who? Finnegan Johnson. Finian. How drunk were his mum and dad? 
Let's call him Finian. Really? When he gets here, when he gets here, let's ask him the names that his mum and dad knock back. Sir? Hello, Finian. Hello, Finian. Your dinner's ready. He shouldn't be in country music, should he? Well, between now and then, between now and when Finian gets here, we'll pick up another name. Any suggestions, let's send me notes. So, we'll go from there. Right, oh, no, Ben, you reckon you're out of this? Guess what? Because we're going to uh, stall a little bit for Finian. There's nothing worse, uh, there's nothing best. Oh, it's the same thing. Let's stick with the band. Have about something? You got something planned? Up tempo? Let's do it. Let's do it. You ready? Do it. Ladies and gentlemen, we better give you a name. I'll tell you what we'll do. Ladies and gentlemen, the Brian Young Band.
How's it going so far? That's only two. You got three to go. All right, not over yet. Not over yet. Right, let's go very, very quickly. Let's get a critique out of the. Uh... Who's got the stand-up champion in the red, white, and blue? You play bowls all day. Good on you, mate. Good chance, he's pissed. Come on, help me, mate. <laughs> Do these mics work? They don't. <laughs> How do we get these mics working? Right, no, 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 nothing at all. What's your name? No, no. No. Yeah. How are you, mate? It's all good. Right, you. You love guitar, don't you? Oh, I love guitar. Right, uh, within probably 60 seconds, would you like to critique Anthony's work so far? Anthony, I thought you were brilliant. The way you played up the neck, mate, was really good. You know, up the neck stuff's really, really hard to do, and you did a really good job of it. The only thing that I'd give you a little bit of advice about, you know, like, you know, you, you, the guitar works wonderful, mate, but I've got to tell you, you've got to get a little bit more anim animation in your face. You know, like, you've got to get a bit more alive. Like, this bloke over here, Phil Hedering, you see the bloke on white over there? He was saying, all we need is a bit more bloody, yeah! And, and he, would have, he would have been in it, mate. But I've got to tell you, no way in the world can you beat a steel guitar. No way in the world can you beat it. <laughs> Thank you, mate. How many points out of ten? You just ripped the shit out of him and he gave him nine and a half out of ten. Okay, well let's break it down. Five, we'll go five for musical talent. So he's a... No, no, six for the musical talent. No, no, hang on. Five, the, in ten we'll, we'll divide. You're from ten words? Yeah, yeah. And we'll go slow. We'll divide, we'll divide ten by two. So we'll give the first five for musical talent. So out of five? Five, half of ten. Yeah. So how many out of, for musical talent, out of five, how many? Five. Five. five yeah. And the dance moves? The dance moves, I reckon, is about point three. <laughs> point three. Bit of work to do. Right on, mate, you're an absolute champion. You got that on board, Anthony? All right. Shadows. We're going to give you a couple of seconds to get those dance moves in your head. Let's call up our first Brian Young memory. Come on, young lady. Don't swear under your breath, because we actually can hear everything up here. Come on up. Now, this is what the other Come on. What's your first name? Leslie. Leslie. Right? I want to see you do that about 10 o'clock. Right, hey, first memory, Leslie, you're from Tamworth? First memory of Youngie was up at the Oasis where most of us met Youngie. And I used to cook in the kitchen. And he lived in the caravan park. So. I done him a deal. I was worried he wasn't eating properly, so I said, Youngie, I'll cook you meals. He goes, right out. So every Friday night there'd be raffles, and every Friday night Youngie would win a prize. And he'd yell out, well, what? <laughs> and he'd yell out, what do you want to cook this week, cookie? And I'd go, whatever you like. So he said to me this night, look, before I go to your place for dinner, can you call him to the garage? And he was smoking back then days, and I went, oh, you want a pack of the smokes? No, 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 just call him to the garage. I went, right up. Into the garage we goes. He comes out with his jacket and he's shoving something in his pocket, and I thought, hmm. Gets down to the dinner table, made him a beautiful baked dinner, homemade gravy, you name it, the lot. <laughs> Into the pocket he goes. Black sauce. <laughs> All over it. And I went, oh, young, you're kidding. He said, mate, I eat black sauce on cereal. <laughs> Put your hands together. Hang on, grab my hand, grab my hand. You ready? This is the last time I said that I got into trouble. It cost me a fortune. Unreal. And it's good to see a lady that can cook and also take direction. You're a rarity. Well, today. I started loving you again. I'm right back where I've really always been. I get over you just long enough to make my heart ease me. And today, I started loving you again. What a fool I was to think I could be right. And only these familiar tears I cry. I just should have known. 
It's all good. So right up, we've got five songs to smash out. Are you ready? Yep. You the boss? No, but I'll give it a go. Right now, ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Kate Daniel. Hey, okay, thank you. Yeah. I'm wide this out. Okay, this first song is one written by a local Tamworth lady called Tracy Costa. The first line in this song means the world to me, because quite often where there's been no one else to blame but me for certain situations. And the song's called City Sidewalks. It's me. 